Welcome to the Voice of Apache. I'm Rich Bowen, and today I'm speaking with Claude Warren, who is the chair of the upcoming Community Over Code conference that will be held in Bratislava in just a, a few weeks now. Those of you that have been listening for years know that we've been doing a conference called ApacheCon since back in 1998. And last year, we rebranded this as Community Over Code. And we had a discussion of that last year, so I won't go into a lot of the details there. But I'm super excited that I'm going to be going to, to Slovakia in June. And Claude is here to, to talk about that event. Thank you for speaking with us today. Thanks for inviting me. So tell me about your vision for this event. Well, I... I got started with this um, because I wanted to see uh, an Apache conference in Europe. It hadn't been one in a couple of years, and I had never attended one here. Uh, I moved to Europe um, over a decade ago now. So I, I thought, well, you know, let's put a, let's see if we can get enough people together that will be interested to, to actually run a conference and managed to, to get that moving and then um, really began to think about what is it that I wanted to see at a conference? So um, I, it feels, it, it has felt to me that when I go to a lot of these technical conferences where you have lots of tracks, that those tracks are very siloed, that people come in, they attend their track, and, and they really don't interact with anybody outside of the track. And I really wanted to get some, some more communication across those tracks. I wanted people to come out and talk to each other and say, hey, well, we're doing this thing and 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 discover that somebody else is doing the same thing and maybe there's some, uh, they can work together and, and, and build a better product or maybe they'll be able to take information from other projects and say, oh yeah, we can apply that to what we're doing and, and you know, just move things along faster, make it uh, more cohesive across all of the, all of the silos effectively. So. And that's there in the name of the event, and and it's something that I've always appreciated about ApacheCon is is the collaborative spaces where where people share ideas, and it's it's been over the years where a number of our projects have in fact made these cross pollinations that have resulted in cool things happening. Yeah. So the, one of the things we're doing to to help promote this is we've got a uh, a. A poster session. So, um, you know, if you if you have a talk or or if you can't attend in person, you could submit a poster. Uh, if you had a talk that, that didn't get accepted, you know, didn't make the we have limited space. So, um, you know, as all conferences do, um, but you could submit a poster, and then uh, we pick those posters. Uh, that, uh, I think there's ten of them now, and uh, we will put those up in a communal space. And the idea is to have people come in and, and be able to look at those posters and see what other people are doing and see what the new ideas are and begin to talk about what that is and what that looks like and how they can apply it to what they're doing uh, and basically provide a space that is open and, and um, for people to, to basically have hallway sessions. <laughs> we've programmed hallway sessions. I don't know if you can do that, but uh, we've given a space for that. So that's, that's our, our goal is to get, get, this, get people talking. And, and get the communication out there, get the ideas flowing. Tell us about a few of the highlights of the content that we'll be running here. How about the keynotes? Well, we have uh, Asim Hassin uh, talking about sustainability, and we have um, our own uh, Dirk Willem will be talking about uh, the some of the EU regulations that are coming up and, and how we might need to work to to be in accordance with those. And then we have um, Dr. Daniel, who did a did a survey of, of a or did a survey of open source projects, and the ASF participated in that. And she will be talking about uh, her results and, and what that looks like, what she discovered. It'll be a lot of fun. We're we're a, it's going to be a small conference, you know, with the Radisson Blue in uh, in Bratislava. We I think we have we have four. Basically, we can run four simultaneous tracks. So we're not you know we don't have lots of rooms. And we don't have a huge space, so we have. Uh, it's going to be a smaller, you know, more intimate conference than, uh, than you're probably used to. Uh, but hopefully, that's going to get you know get those juices flowing and get people talking uh, more so than, than a larger conference might. 
To find out more information about this event, go to eu.communityovercode.org. And this will also be linked from many of our apache.org websites. For those of us on the American side of the pond, where the heck is Bratislava and how do I get there? Yeah, um, the easiest way to get to Bratislava, it's in Slovakia, um, not to be confused with Slovenia, which apparently is very common even in Europe. And the easiest way to get there is really to fly into Vienna. And then from Vienna, you can go by bus or by train or by boat. And I'm going, I'm going by boat because I wasn't going to miss that opportunity. And so you can, you can take a cruise up the Danube to go to your conference. So if you're coming with your partner, that might be the best bet. You know, it could be romantic. <laughs> <laughs> so, it, you know, it, it is, um, in some sense, it's a little more difficult to get to. Uh, on the other hand, you know, Vienna is fairly easy, and this is a, a fairly short trip by bus or boat or train. Uh, to get to the conference, and it, it is a um, it's an older it's an old city. Uh, it's got lots of historic buildings, um, and it's uh, I have not been there myself, but uh, from what I have seen and what I have heard, it is a, it is really a beautiful city, and uh, it should be interesting and, and a nice place to to wander around and and uh, talk with people and. Now it should be a pleasant couple of days there in in, uh, in June. So we're there the third, fourth, and fifth. Well, I'm I'm really looking forward to this event. Um, for those of you in other parts of the world, we do have two other events that are coming up this year. Community Over Code North America will be in Denver in October, and Community Over Code Asia will be in Hangzhou in China on. July 26th through 28th. So we have global coverage this year, and we look forward to seeing all of you at one or more of those events. Thank you. And this should be uh, should be an interesting year to it'd be nice to be able to do all of the events. You know? Oh, it would. I'm not going to be able to do that this year, but uh, I, I get to do be... one. <laughs> well, I'll see you in Bratislava. All right. We'll see you there. Thanks.